do this. All right, I'm here with Rafael Zamora, part of the uh, Data Center Solutions field sales team. How are you doing, Raf? I'm doing good. Great. Two thumbs up. All right, so we just uh, announced our new Power Edge C servers. Can Absolutely. you just show us a, a quick overview of the line? Actually, I have all three of the products that we actually talked about today. So uh, check this out. C6100, this yep. product right here, uh, just a brief overview of it. To you form factor, uh, and its best use case is for compute environments where you need a lot of compute density and a small amount of real estate, right? Uh, don't think about it as a compromise. It's really an efficient package to condense f the equivalent of four pizza box systems, one U systems comparable to the R610, into a very tight, discrete, small package. Excellent. And this right. would be great for HPC? HPC is great. A lot of the cloud and the cluster optimized compute, it's uh, really catching on like wildfire. Cool. All right. What's next in the lineup? Let's talk about the C1100 right next to it, which is its brother product. Uh, as you can see, the form factor is a little different. We go from 2U to 1U. Uh, because it's a 1U space, don't think that it d it's emitting a lot of features, right? Uh, within inside this 1U form factor, you can host four three and a half inch drives or ten two and a half inch drives it's got this very very powerful system board design that enables it to have two socket tylersburg chip nehalem and westmere class microprocessors 18 dim sticks expansion slots excellent platform for high memory optimized compute nodes Excellent. And then last but not least? Last but not least, think about it as its bigger brother, right? If the C1100 was an, an extra large C2100, it would, it, that's what it would be. We take the same system board design, put it into a bigger real estate chassis. We go from 1U back up to 2U. Larger amount of real estate, what does that get us? Gives us a whole bunch of drives up in front. And that whole bunch of drives equates to 12, 3.5 or 24 two and a half inch drives. Hey, the coolest thing, see this little spot up here? Yeah. It enables me to actually, well, you know, my terminology here, our terminology internally is uh, to bury a couple solid state drives or any localized drives. So besides all the disk spindles up in front, I could add an additional two drives back here. Everything that I spoke about in that other system board, those 18 dim sticks, those two awesome two socket processors, same board. But because of the real estate, I'm able to put two more carts. Oh, very cool. All three systems complementary, but it's just the taste of what's to come. Excellent. Raph, thank you so much.